you. Oh, Turn that way. Water. Give me water. Water, is it? Oh. Tell me. Tell me, Pitt. I can... Go on working. Don't look at me. I... I just come from the boat. It's hidden in South Cove at the end of the path. We'll make a break for it tonight. Tonight? Yes, till Wolves and Ogle and Hegthorpe and the others were in with us. It's a small boat for so many, Peter Blythe. I've looked it over well. I've been there all afternoon. It'll hold a lot of us. Are you out of stores and equipment on board? Yes, there's enough for it. Careful. Let's miss him. Peter Blood. Peter Blood, do you hear? I, when I'm addressed civilly, a taste of the lash might improve your hearing. Uncle, please. <laughs> Be quiet. Where have you been? I've been at my work. Attending to the governor at his house. You lie. Do I? The governor has had another attack of gout. He's been screaming for you like a wounded horse all afternoon. Well, then, it appears I was not at the governor's house. Where were you, then? Well, I was... He was with me, Uncle. Eh? Hey? What's that? Thank you for protecting my reputation, Dr. Blood. But it was a useless gallantry. My uncle knows that I spend my time with whomever I please. You might choose your company with better taste. His Excellency is waiting for you, Blood. I will bet I'm coming. Get on up to the house, Blood, and don't delay. Would you care to drive up, Dr. Blood? Well, I... Thank you. Drive on. <laughs> Miss Bishop, I'd like to... You're very welcome, Dr. Blood. It seems that you're continually doing me favors. Hey, I don't know why. Neither do I. Yes, I do. It's because you're so very grateful and always thank me so prettily. Sure, now, you don't blame me for resenting you in your favors. This is interesting. I've had men tell me they have reasons for admiring me, and some few have even had claims to reasons for loving me. But for a man to store up reasons for resenting me, how refreshing. You must tell me a few of them. The first is reason enough. You bought me. I've had no lack of experiences in my life, but to be bought and sold was a new one. And I was in no mood to thank my purchaser. At any rate, I'm unable to stoop to lick up the scraps of favors tossed to me. I'm glad for that. Next. Well, I've resented you because your name's Bishop. My thoughts have lumped you with your uncle. How was I to know, be dead, that a devil can have a... That a devil can have an angel, a niece. I'm a resentful man. That is a pretty fair compliment. Have you any more reasons for resenting me like that one? Indeed I have, and the strongest of all. I've resented you because... Because I'm a slave and you're beautiful. Do you understand that? I... I don't know. If you were to explain further... No, I've already talked too much. Why did you lie to your uncle? Why did you tell him I was with you? Why? Dr. Blood, you're a physician and should know... Is it not considered unhealthy for a slave to be seen at a boat? At a boat? Why should it be? Boats put out to sea. Slaves may not. You're jumping at conclusions, aren't you? Why? This afternoon I happened to drive past the South Cove. Fortunately, I was alone at the time. I see. Miss Bishop, it's difficult for an Irishman to apologize... But I hope you can forgive me for having thought badly of you. I will. I will if you tell me what you think of me now. How I think of you? I think of you as... <laughs> Faith. I think of you as the woman who owns me. A slave. Oh. But I think the man is lucky who can count you his friend. I think you know you can. <gasps> what was that? Sounded like cannon. It was. Look at the men in the field. They're looking towards the bay. It must be... Wait. Can you see? Yes, there's a fleet sailing in. Spanish man of war. Spanish? Then it's an attack. A surprise attack. Quick, into the house. Where are you going? I've got to see the men. We've worked to do. Stop the blood from that. Don't go down there. Peter, Peter. Jeremy, what was the logo? I be the blood. Kill everyone. Everyone, just to defend the bay. Defend the bay. Aye, that we will. Listen, all of you. 
Oh, this is our job. Our chance to be drilled by a cannon. Oh, and listen. I want you to gather all the slaves, as many as have a spark of courage, and follow me down to the waterfront. What for? We need a boat, do we not? Aye. Right. And we'll have one. But none of your skulking little craft. We'll take a good one, a Spanish man of war. We'll board her under the fire from the other ships. Take command of her. Turn our cannons on any Spanish boat that blocks our way to the sea. Aye. It's a long chance, friends, but with the help of God, we'll make it. Are you with me? Aye. It's a miracle, I say. Did you see that boat, Colonel Bishop? A Spanish man of war saved the town from destruction. A Spanish boat, but manned by Englishmen, I'll warrant. She sunk the rest of the Spanish fleet and holds the bay alone. It must be that some brave party of citizens got aboard that ship and have taken it captive. Gad, I think you're right. Someone should go aboard and congratulate them. Yes, yes, I... I'll have the longboat row me out. Oh. I'll not be long, Your Excellency. I hope your uncle does them full honor out there. They deserve it, Your Excellency. Whoever commanded that party was a brave man. A very brave man. I... I wonder who it could have been. I... Spanish man of war, ahoy! They don't out the Colonel. Isn't that strange? I'll go aboard. Pull over there by the ladder. <coughs> Stand by the boat. I'll be down directly. Aye, sir. <coughs> ahoy, is anybody here? Welcome aboard our boat, Colonel Darwin. You? I? Peter Blood. Was it you, then, who took this ship and turned defeat into victory? Myself it was. Myself and these, my friends, and, uh, your friends. Uh, God, my life, it, uh, it was heroic. Heroic, is it? Hey, Dad, it was that? <laughs> well, you amaze me. Upon this soul, you amaze me. Blast me, you deserve well. You all deserve well, and you shall find me grateful. Uh, How grateful? Well, I'll, I'll ask His Excellency to write home to the King on account of your exploit. And maybe some portion of your sentence shall be remitted. The bite will be expected from you. <laughs> <laughs> Colonel Darlin, such unusual generosity from you must be making you feel very ill. Now, as your physician, I prescribe... Hang it! No, 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 wait. We've done no hanging yet, man. Ogle, what do you suggest? So they took up Jonah and cast him forth into the sea. <laughs> Are you ready, men? No, no. Put me down. No. Hey! No. Oh. Oh. <laughs> and then the whale came and swallowed Jonah, I hope. <laughs> what now, Captain Blood? Captain, is it? Aye! 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 A new name, eh? Very well. We'll call her the Arabella. The Arabella it is! All right. <laughs>